Whether it's for her tennis matches or Instagram posts, Rachel Stuhlman is the talk of the town. And just recently in a busty pink top, she revealed the three things that she's excited for. Stay tuned to find out. Who has the hottest influencer so excited? If you're a tennis fan, it's hard to miss Rachel Stuhlman, the self-branded sexiest tennis influencer. She's also the number one tennis influencer in the business, with a crazy 262,000 Instagram followers. People know her for her amazing style and all the content she posts on the platform. Rachel keeps her fans entertained by posting updates from her life on the court and outside the court as well. But enough with the wait, let's get into the three things she's most excited about in 2023. Just like any other tennis fan, Rachel is very excited about the new season. But what she's most excited about is the success of the United Cup's inaugural mixed gender team event. And the Australian Open, which started on January 16th in Melbourne, comes in second place for her. But the last thing she's excited about will probably leave you the most shocked. The third thing she's excited about is some Netflix. A new documentary called Breakpoint to be exact. The documentary features a lot of tennis stars like Nick Kyrgios, Taylor Fritz, and some other big names. So it makes sense for Rachel to be looking forward to it. This obviously means that Rachel loves everything tennis, and a recent clip is proof of that. In a recent interview, she praised the United Cup for being a competition for both men and women while wearing a black top with a low neckline. Rachel added a poll asking her fans what they thought about the event. She loved the event and confessed that she was happy that it was a mixed gender team event. Rachel showing her excitement, think about being on the same team as Rafael Nadal or Paulo Badoza. The USA beat Italy 4-0 over the weekend to win the first United Cup, and Rachel is already excited about the 2023 United Cup event. A question you might ask though, is she in it for the views? Rachel Stuhlman isn't just any tennis influencer who watches and posts about the sport to get likes. She has played the sport herself. So I do a lot in the professional tennis space. Um, I was a player. I played in college and um, now I do a lot within the sport. I, the last like five, six years, I've done everything from like sponsorships and partnerships, marketing, sales, all this different stuff. Rachel started playing tennis when she was five years old. By the time she was a teenager, she was ranked nationally on the USTA junior circuit and went on to play tennis in college at the NCAA Division I level. Not only that, Rachel is also a good tennis writer. She started her own website five years ago so she could write articles and help her readers understand the game better. Rachel also writes about tennis fashion on her website, which has gotten a lot of positive feedback, which makes her feel great. This year, the super hot influencer will do something different. In fact, Rachel is already working on it. She said not long ago that all this is to say that she's finally coming full circle. Rachel revealed that she's been working very hard on a project that she can't wait to show us all. Since a lot has changed in the last five years, she has remade and relaunched her website from scratch. Rachel said that she can't wait to tell us all about her journey through travel updates and newsletters, highlights from her partnerships, and more. Um, that's been really fun, and my goal for everything this whole time has been to make the sport of tennis more mainstream and relatable and like just cool like the other sports. I always felt like it didn't get the attention and like recognition and the players weren't really getting the recognition that they, they deserve. So I'm like, I feel like this is what I want to do. She once confidently claimed that she was good enough and that she could have gotten there eventually to professional tennis stardom. That is, if she hadn't thrown in the towel. So why did she decide to retire from the game? Well, she just didn't want to deal with the tight travel schedule. Rachel realized that it would take her five to seven years to get to the top, and she didn't want to live the kind of life that came with playing in small towns and basically living out of a car. Instead, Rachel decided to be an influencer in the world of tennis, even though she said that she fell into it by accident. She claimed that she's done so much in professional tennis. Rachel's done everything from media, writing, marketing, sales, tournament sponsorships, and partnerships, player relationships, and much more. She admitted that the sport has taken her to so many different tournaments and so many amazing places that, in so many amazing places that she just started posting along the way. Rachel revealed that she decided she wanted to talk about the cool parts of the sport, like traveling and cool clothes. And she appreciates how greatly the people have reacted. So, and you know, tennis is so special that every single week, besides a couple weeks in November and December, 
there's a tournament somewhere around the world. There's actually multiple professional tournaments somewhere around the world and they're on, um, you know, very well done and, and they're all in really cool cities. And uh, I think that's also what makes the sport pretty special. It's global and it's all year round. People from all over the world have sent her support and so many messages telling me that they are now interested in tennis because of her. She confessed that it's been a lot of fun for her. But there's more to the story than just that. The 31-year-old sexy tennis star has become the number one influencer in the sport. She has gained an incredible audience on Instagram, who are drawn to her glam photos, stylish outfits, and the love of the court. But the hot brunette doesn't want to turn off female fans who might be jealous of her beautiful curves. Instead, she wants to give women confidence and make them feel positive about their bodies. Rachel hopes to achieve this by showing her female fans how to use her exercise plans to stay slim like her. She also opened up about online trolls and said that they were after her because of her sudden rise. She wants to spread the love about the game to more and more people. Rachel said that she thinks that no matter what, every woman should be proud of her body. She wants to give women more power, not push them away or make them feel bad because they don't look like her. The tennis influencer added that she knows about Instagram and body ideals, and she does not want to contribute to a problem for young girls. To achieve this, she not only posts pictures of herself when she's looking good and pretty, but also shows how hard she worked to get that look. She claimed that she posts more because of her love for tennis than because of her looks and beauty. But she believes that everyone should celebrate how they look and who they are. Even if it wasn't always easy for her to do the same. With the good comes the bad. The tennis circle can be a bit stuffy, but Rachel hasn't had much trouble fitting in. She said that, in general, everyone has shown her a lot of love, which has been great. Rachel also revealed that early on in her career, a few people bullied her. But like the girl boss she is, she didn't let that bother her. Instead, she decided to be herself, which turned out to be one of the best decisions of her life. The more popular she has become online, the more trolls have made her a target. She confessed that the world isn't perfect, and as she continues to grow on social media platforms, not everyone loves her. Rachel revealed that some people say mean things about everything, and that bothers her sometimes. She added that she's a person, and she's got some great friends and faith, so she'll never go to a dark place. At the moment, Rachel is happy to preach about the sport she loves so much. She said that she wants to keep spreading love throughout the game. Rachel also confessed that she'd love to keep traveling and showing off the different tournaments from around the world. That was all for what the sexiest tennis influencer is so excited about and why she does what she does. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for videos just like this one. That's all for today. See you in the next video.